Have you ever heard of gene therapy before? Its risks or benefits? Or maybe you're interested on how it can enhance human traits as well as being a treatment for diseases. Hi, I'm Patchy, and my team and I... Hi guys, I'm Yellow. Hi, I'm Trisha. I'm Cass. And I'm Sadre. Are here to make you aware of all of these. Let's get started. So guys, what are the benefits that you can get from this? Gene therapy involves replacing a faulty gene or adding a new gene in an attempt to cure disease or improve your body's ability to fight disease. Gene therapy has the potential to treat a wide range of diseases including cancer, cystic fibrosis, heart disease, diabetes, hemophilia, and AIDS. Gene therapy has the potential to improve or restore function in affected tissues or cells over time allowing a patient to manage his or her disease without the need for ongoing treatments. But how about its risk? There are concerns about gene therapy include the procedure's risk and could develop an immune reaction to the virus upon receiving the treatment. The body's immune system may perceive the newly acquired viruses as intruders and attack them, which can cause inflammation and in severe cases, organ failure. Introducing a new gene into body cells and keeping them working is extremely difficult. But to answer the question at hand, gene therapy is only a clinical trial and it is very risky because of the evidence that an 18-year-old Arizona man with a rare metabolic disease died while participating in a controversial gene therapy experiment. The efficiency of gene transfer and the expression of the corrective genes in the human patients is still very low and it is has also a side effects that include fever, severe chills called rigors, blood pressure drop, nausea, vomiting, headache, serious health risks such as toxicity, inflammation, and cancer which can lead to death. Although gene therapy has the potential to be beneficial, it also carries a higher risk. Targeting a gene to the correct cell is crucial to the success of any gene therapy treatment and delivering a gene to the wrong tissue would be inefficient which would cause health problems for the patient. A fit athlete flexing on a social media or commercial model with a personalized skin. For some, they consider gene therapy to achieve the human traits they've always wanted to have. Most people value physical beauty, so much they do tanning, exercise, diet, surgeries, cosmetic enhancement. Gene therapy presents a promising way of improving human traits such as skin color and athletic abilities. If gene therapy could be sentimental in achieving this characteristic, then people should be allowed to undergo it. In 2018, Chinese scientists discovered a special gene. KI TLG that controls skin color and resists cold temperature, while CRISPR, a method of genetic editing to design a future athletes, can increase a person's mass or body proportion. As of now further, studies and evaluation is needed to assist gene therapy. However, people should understand the pros and cons of the processes and even the risks involved in achieving their hashtag body goals as long as their safety is assured and they are capable of paying for it, then they should be allowed. As we all know, our cells contain parts called genes, and they mostly control the chemical reaction in the cell that determines the growth and the function of a human being. We inherit some of our genes from our parents, and thus, the parents pass on certain traits to their offspring. Gene therapy is known to be a technology that involves altering genetic materials of an organism such as human beings. Gene therapy pursues to alter specific genes and correct genetic defects, projecting human abilities like height and intelligence. Along with this comes genetic engineering, with the goal to modify the genes to enhance the capabilities of a human being beyond what is normal. Thus, with the two present, they aim to enhance some human abilities, such as we have mentioned above. But remember, not all can be accurate, and not all can be done without a concern. Analyze the answer given, yes, it can be allowed, but the given the risk and the limited studies that are shown. It is better to not go through with it when it is not recommended or needed, or wait for the near future where more tests and studies will be done, and specialists and doctors 
can suggest these options to you. Now, this might be one of the anticipated questions asked. Gen therapy is a promising possibility for the treatment of these diseases. With the help of genetically modified viruses, DNA is introduced into cells in order to repair or replace defective genes. By using this method, scientists have discovered a quicker and more efficient treatment for the cells. In order for both researchers and scientists to further the success rate of gene therapy and make it able to be more widely used, it is better first to have the clinical trial because people are different from one another and as a result, different reactions the body will have. By promoting gene therapy that is more effective, it will be more valuable to those who will use it. It is better and more reliable than other sources. Because of its accuracy, gen therapy has the potential to eliminate cancer cells without damaging the healthy tissues. Furthermore, cancer gen therapy may provide alternatives to when a disease does not respond to other ordered treatments. Gen therapy is something that is not that widely known, especially for youth our age. But hopefully, with those questions answered, you have been more informed and given insights regarding this subject matter. Don't you agree, team? Yes, but I hope our viewers have gained some insights in those few questions. Remember, it is better first to be informed or do your research before going through a process that you are clueless about. That's true. Yep. It's better than safe than sorry. And with that, I hope you enjoyed our small presentation vlog regarding gene therapy. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and please share our presentation. Thank you, everyone! Bye! Bye.